What's up YouTube? Mike here from Techno GI and today I wanted to do a quick review of a very simple but yet very useful device and that is the pluggable, get it where you can see it, uh, USB 3.0 adapter. Essentially is what this does, this allows you to take a, your USB port and turn it into either a VGA, DVI or HDMI. So if your computer is lacking in ports or you don't have a display out but you do have a USB 3.0, then you can uh, use this little gizmo. I actually got this on Amazon and it was basically 50 bucks. So totally worth it. I've been using it. Um, no complaints whatsoever. I've been using it to drive the uh, Samsung TV you see behind me using my Microsoft Surface 3 docking station. So as I mentioned during my review of the docking station, <clears throat> the one complaint I had over the Surface Pro 3 docking station is my one display out port is covered on the device and on the docking station only has one. So I wanted to run two monitors externally that is, so I had to get this little guy. So let me show you kind of the hardware of this. So like I said, here's the actual device. You know, it just runs to a USB 3.0. And as you can see, it comes with two adapters. You got this one, which allows you to run it to an HDMI. And then it comes with this one, which allows you to go to the DVI, uh, or I'm sorry, VGA. But the adapter itself, or I'd say the actual uh, home uh, gizmo, is actually the DVI. Now, I really don't know who uses DVI anymore. It's probably obsolete for the most part. So the standard out there really is VGA and or HDMI. And really the only negative and only complaint I have about this is that it does not do audio out. So if you're hooking this to an external monitor with speakers, i.e. like I haven't run into the Samsung TV, the sound will not project. Um, so that is a negative. Um, I don't know if, if it's ever possible to solve that issue running from a, um, a USB to the HDMI. But anyway, so just know that if you order this, that is a limitation. Uh, whatever you have it plugged into, it will not send the audio signal. But other than that, um, installation is super quick and easy. You got to go to the Plugwell website and download a driver. Took like five minutes max and then you're up and running. Now this is compatible with Mac, sorta. Um, I personally haven't tried it. All I did was look at their, uh, their website. So according to the Plugable website, it's kind of in a beta version, but it will support um, later versions of, of a Mac. So if you wanna use this to run from your iMac or MacBook Pro, um, theoretically it should work, but again, I would do the research before you buy it. Personally, I'm using it for my Surface 3, and I know that works for a fact. Um, yeah, what else on this? Like I said, this will support monitors up to 2048 by 1152 resolution at 60 hertz. Um, I've tried gaming with it and I've noticed zero lag whatsoever. So like I said, this is a super quick and easy and relatively cheap solution to actually being able to run a second monitor. So highly recommend it. Um, totally worth the money. Like I said, if you've seen my earlier videos, you see it running in the background. Right now, obviously, I don't have it hooked up, um, but it does work. No issues whatsoever. So with that, hopefully that helps you guys out if you're looking for a quick, easy, cheap solution to run another monitor. So as always, if you haven't done so, you can always hit that little red subscribe button and give me a thumbs up. Thanks.